Hello and welcome back to another edition of Austin's American Flyer, where today I'm inviting you to join me on what I'm going to call Austin's Big Day Out. Why is it a big day and why is it a big deal? Because where I live, it might as well be the Sahara Desert when it comes to American Flyer. There's just really not much around. And so um, while there are some of you that are lucky enough to get into groups and have clubs and whatnot that you pal around with other people that are in the Flyer world, uh, well, like I said, I might as well be living in the, on an island in the middle of the Pacific. So today is about a special treat where I was invited to participate in a group of people that have an SKH club. And uh, so that was kind of exciting. And uh, so this video is about that. And you're going to get to see today a layout tour, which you've seen this before, but you're going to see it differently uh, than you did previously. Uh, so stick around for that. Also, um, we got to see not one, but two steam engines. And uh, so that's of interest. Number three, we got to go on a museum tour that includes some pretty cool stuff in terms of the real world of trains, but also, more importantly, there's a direct correlation to American Flyer. Don't want to miss that. It's pretty awesome. And last but not least, I'm going to show you a little bit about the upcoming S Spree that this particular club is going to be putting on. It happens in April. Near the end of the video, I'll give you some additional details about it. And I would love it if you would come. Uh, it's going to be all S gauge, which is pretty awesome. And I hear that there's going to be a certain clinician that looks a lot like this guy right here. So if you can come, it would be great. I would love to meet you in person. Uh, also, you're supporting a bunch of people that are trying to promote the hobby. So that's awesome. And what's also cool, they have designed a box car uh, that's one of these unique box cars that's only going to be made uh, for this particular event. You've got a couple of numbers that you can pick from and uh, have a little more information on that. Whether or not you come to this event, you can still order that box car. And uh, you end up with a box car, you end up supporting uh, an S gauge group as they try to promote the hobby. So it's kind of a win, 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 win all the way around. So please stick around today and join me as I spend a few hours with the Ohio Miami Valley S gauge group today on Austin's American Flyer.
<laughs> We've had this in, since uh, 1956. This is the third location on the property. We used to have here on Metcalf Street, though, we had what we called the Shea Shed. You wouldn't have liked that in the summertime. It was a tight little building with a lot of glass windows and it got hotter than I'll get out. A couple people kind of bolted out of there and all this when we were playing the show in town. Then we had it here on the corner for a while in a temporary. Like I say, it's getting cosmetically restored. Uh, we looked inside the boiler area there and at that time there was just newspapers all day and we moved all the tubing, of course. So that's part of that. You want to swing around a little bit and get a chance to see the uh, dive here.
get a chance to team up with uh, or join in with the Miami Valley S Gauge Group, you won't want to miss it. A bunch of incredibly great people, men and women that uh, have to hap happen to have this awesome hobby they all enjoy, and uh, then they're great people to boot. It's, again, a win, 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 all the way around. All right, until next time, take care of yourself. God bless, enjoy those American Flyer trains, and we'll see you. Bye-bye.